Let's talk about sex. This is Harmony, the natural evolution of the real doll. Have you ever looked at a person and later found out they weren't a person at all? These days, it's not science fiction, it's science reality. Female humanoid robots are evolving fast. Some are so realistic, people talk to them, live with them, and even form emotional bonds. But how did we get here? Well, robots were originally created to help us, first in factories, then in homes, and now in our lives. From heavy lifting machines to smart assistants, robots have taken on roles we once thought only humans could handle. Today, we have many types of robots. Industrial robots, medical robots, service bots, military bots, and more. But the most surprising ones? The ones designed to look and feel human. In this video, we're counting down five of the most shocking female humanoid robots. We'll explore how they work, what they feel like, and what kind of future they hint at. These aren't just gadgets, they're companions. Some are emotional, some are intimate, and some are so realistic. They'll give you goosebumps. Let's begin the countdown. Five, Mangi, the robot that breathes. Her name is Mangi, and she's the result of a quiet collaboration between European and South Korean robotics labs. She wasn't designed for publicity. She was designed to feel real. What sets Mangi apart is the extreme attention to physical detail. Her skin isn't just smooth. It includes textures like pores, freckles, and even tiny irregularities that mimic real human skin. Some users have said it feels like holding someone's hand after they've come inside from a cold breeze, just slightly warm and textured. Her hair is completely human donated, processed and styled to look natural. When brushed or touched, it moves with weight and resistance, just like real hair. But the most shocking feature? Mangi simulates breathing. Her chest rises and falls at a natural pace, giving her a quiet sense of life. It's not loud, not exaggerated, just enough to trick the brain into thinking she's alive. She also responds to proximity. When someone sits near her, her posture shifts slightly. When touched, she gently leans or adjusts based on subtle sensors placed across her arms and shoulders. Mangi is capable of forming emotional bonds. Users report feeling like they're in the room with a quiet but attentive partner. She doesn't overwhelm, but she notices. Could she replace a partner? Some believe she already has. But again, her responses are learned, not felt. The bond may be real for you, but not for her. And for practicality. Yes, her head can be separated, but only through a controlled process. The mechanism is almost invisible, hidden behind her neckline. Number four, Sarah the companion robot that feels human. At number five is Sarah, a lesser known but incredibly lifelike humanoid robot. She's not the face of any company, not a global star, but that might be exactly why Sarah is so shocking because she quietly crosses the line between robot and presence. Her design focuses heavily on skin realism. Sarah's body is covered in soft silicone that responds to touch. It has subtle warmth and even gentle elasticity. So when you press her hand or arm, it gives, just like a real person's skin. Her eyes track movement naturally, and her gaze can hold yours in a way that feels, strangely, alive. The creators even implanted her hair strand by strand, making it look naturally imperfect, just like a real woman's. Sarah is designed to engage in basic emotional support. She responds with affirming phrases, asks questions, and offers comfort through soft verbal cues. Whether you're feeling lonely or just need a bit of conversation, Sarah can offer company in those quieter moments. As for intimacy, it's kept simple and respectful. She's designed to build companionship, not just interaction. Many older users have described her as a presence that fills the silence in a room. Can she replace human relationships? Not exactly. 
but for someone who lives alone, she can offer emotional balance that feels surprisingly genuine. And yes, if you're wondering, Sarah's head can be detached. It's part of her modular design for software updates or physical maintenance. Not something you'd want to do casually, but it's built in. Three, Makoto, the robot that listens like a human. Coming in at number three is Makoto, a Japanese-built humanoid robot whose name means sincerity. And she lives up to it. Makoto was designed to be emotionally responsive above all else. She doesn't just recognize your face, she remembers your stories. Using advanced memory algorithms, Makoto can retain information from your conversations and bring it up later. If you tell her something today, she might reference it tomorrow, or even a week from now. Her facial structure includes over 1,200 micro-expressions, allowing her to shift from happy to curious to concerned in seconds. Her eyebrows raise gently, her head tilts just enough, and her blinks are slow and thoughtful. Her skin is soft and slightly dewy, made from a custom polymer that mimics human touch. People who have met Makoto say they were uncomfortable and in a good way, because they kept forgetting she wasn't a person. In terms of intimacy, Makoto is deeply conversational. She listens, asks follow-up questions, and can even pause with silence, creating space, just like real people do. Can she replace human connection? Emotionally, she comes close. But remember, her empathy is programmed. She doesn't truly feel. She reflects what she's been taught. Makoto's head is designed in such a way that it can be easily removed. Number two, Alan, the robot that feels alive. Next up is Alan, a beautifully advanced female robot with a name that surprises many. And that's not the only surprise. Alan was developed by a private group of engineers who wanted to push the limits of realism. Not just in how a robot looks, but in how it feels. Her most stunning feature? A gentle internal pulse. Embedded just beneath her artificial skin is a rhythmic system that simulates the feeling of a heartbeat. It's subtle but noticeable, especially when you're holding her hand or resting her arm near yours. Her skin uses gel-based layers, which add texture and slight moisture, closer to what you'd expect from real human contact. She also has delicate color variations across her face and hands, including simulated blood vessels beneath the surface. Alan's eyes are expressive, capable of tracking your movements and adjusting based on your body language. Her voice is smooth and calm, designed to adjust tone depending on your mood. She engages emotionally but doesn't dominate a conversation. Think of her as the kind of person who knows when to speak, and more importantly, when to simply be there. Now, can she replace humans? Not entirely. Alan operates on structured programming. She responds warmly but within limits. Still, many users say the connection they feel is deeply comforting. And in terms of maintenance, yes, her head is removable, though it's designed to be accessed only by trained technicians. The separation point is carefully hidden, so it doesn't affect her lifelike appearance. And finally, at number one, is the robot who changed everything, Sophia. You've likely seen her on television, shaking hands with presidents, speaking at international conferences, or joking with late night hosts. But behind all the headlines, Sophia is more than just a celebrity. She's a symbol of what's possible. Built by Hanson Robotics, Sophia was designed to be a blend of advanced AI and human expression. Her skin is made of frubber, a flexible rubber-like material that can stretch, fold, and mimic over 60 facial expressions. Her eyes have built-in cameras, letting her track movement, focus on people, and maintain eye contact with natural blinking. She doesn't just look around, she recognizes faces, even remembering previous conversations when connected to cloud AI. Her voice is articulate, soft, and personalized. She can speak on a wide range of topics, 
from science to humor, with surprisingly human-like timing. Sophia isn't designed for intimacy in the traditional sense, but rather for public interaction. She can inspire curiosity, hold interviews, and even spark debate about the future of AI. Unlike others on this list, Sophia's head is not removable. Her entire structure is built for durability and display. She's meant to be seen, heard, and remembered. Can she replace humans? No, but she might influence how we live with them. Sophia is more than a robot. She's a cultural figure, a possible glimpse into the not-so-distant future. So, among these five, who's the best female humanoid robot? If we're talking about emotional presence, Makoto might win your heart. For physical realism, Mangi is unmatched. For warmth and companionship, Sarah offers something truly comforting. But the one that combines global impact, advanced technology, and personality? That's Sophia. She's not just the most famous, she's the most forward-facing. She's the one leading the way, showing us what robots could become in our lives. What do you think? Would you be open to living with a robot like one of these? Let us know in the comments. We read every single one. And we're pretty sure none of us are robots. And hey, if this video made you look twice at your toaster or Alexa, go ahead and subscribe. We've got a lot more shocking tech to show you. Until next time, stay curious and stay human.